Hi friends, today we are going to discuss about some attributes of standard messages that you can configure for your help without any development. Okay, so let me tell you what I'm talking about. So I'm going to ME23N, ME22N to be precise. Okay, and here suppose uh, there are lots of times, you know, here is the date. Okay, and if you notice the date is in the past okay now here when I click on here and I click on the messages not messages sorry if you click on the log here you will see this if you see the statistical delivery miss date is in the past so this is a warning in SAP when I started working with SAP anything information and warning you just ignore that's how it is like you know it's like the yellow light, <laughs> the traffic light. You just go through it, okay? And it's not advisable, but, you know, if it's red, then only. So suppose you want this to me to be red, how you can do it? The first thing you have to do is you just double click on it, okay? And from here, you get the message number, ME. So statistical uh, delivery date is in the past, okay? So this one, I will change it to me589 so that's the number so now next what i'm going to do is i'm going to this transaction olme you can go through spro but this is an easy transaction for purchasing olme so i go here okay press olme Oops. okay here it is olme now i go to environment data and define attributes of system message now i click on system messages okay and here i need to search with that id which i got so i know in the other screen the id was 589 right so i'll just go click here and i go page down page down let me go to the me section here is the me section it's moving fast so there is 589. So if here, if you see, it's W. So I can put E and I click Save. And this is a customizing request. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'll close it. And probably I will have to come here again. Okay. And I'll just go to ME22N again here on this transaction. Okay. And here, if you see, I go and change this and I click this. Now, you see, this is now coming as an error message. So, this is very easy. Okay. The most, what, what I did is nothing but I went to find the messages. First thing I did is find the message and go to OLME and follow the path that I showed and just made it error. So I'll just change it again to W and this will do the magic. Okay. So now it's saved. <clears throat> I'll close this. Okay. And next time, so it's clicking OK because it's in the buffer. So I'll go ME22N and it's just coming. And here now I will go to change this date again and we will see it will be back to 1 see this message now is back to one okay so uh, so this way you can do a lot of things in purchasing there would be separate videos for other transaction codes okay so that's it stay tuned to my sap channel and happy sap learning and have a great